Once you understand that when you're playing the game of Google and you understand or you realize that the rules don't apply to everyone equally, that's when you start looking at different strategies and thinking these strategies are how I can actually get my content found on Google versus just posting it on my site and hoping that Google blesses me with being indexed. Check this out. This is over my AI blog, universeunriddled.com. URL is not on Google. This is the book of Enoch and the Watchers. We're going to take a look at this here in a second. But understand that then this URL is on Google. Now, when I'm looking at this post versus this post, in my opinion, they're pretty much equal. But if you go to Google and you search for universeunriddled.com or site universeunriddled.com, you can see I have lots of things indexed. But if you go and you look for that specific post, it leaves you scratching your head. What do I need to do to fix that post? It's been crawled. Go back to the inspection. It says indexing allowed. Yes, but they have decided that the page is not indexed because they crawled it and they decided that it's not worthy of being indexed. And I show you all that just so you understand the game of Google is not a level playing field, but a strategy that can help you once you understand how it works, is Parasite SEO. And doing that over at Medium, utilizing the power of Medium to get your content found and then link back to your site, even if Google has decided not to index individual posts or anything at all, you can create posts here on Medium. And then you go and you can see here the Book of Enoch overview. Again, the Book of Enoch. And you can then go and search your Medium site. And you can see here that this three days ago, Three days ago, I wrote this blog post for Medium, the Book of Enoch, Enoch Overview. Three days ago, again, three days ago, it's now indexed on Google. Here is the article. If you were to take this article and just look at it and see just at a glance, say, what is the difference between this article and then this article that I posted on my website? where you would look at this and you would say, this is just a better better article. It has internal links, external links. It has different images. It's broken down. It's just better visually appealing. And it's on my site with lots of other information. Go back to Medium. But again, three days ago, I wrote this and posted it on Medium and Google decided to index it. Google indexed it because of the power of Medium. Utilizing the power of a site, Medium, Reddit, Quora, any other site that has that kind of power, if you were to write a guest blog and post it on a blog that has the level of power that Medium does, three days later, your post is indexed with basically the same information, a little twist because you're posting it on Medium and you are looking to build an audience on Medium, of course, because you want to utilize their platform and play by their rules because Medium has rules just like Google has rules. But after we posted that three days ago, now we go to Google and we search for the Book of Enoch and Intriguing Theories of Extraterrestrial Contact, you can see here it's number two after a YouTube video. Now you may say, Gary, that's a long tail keyword or nobody's typing that in. Okay, the Book of Enoch and Extraterrestrial Contact. Again, the Medium post right here from three days ago is still on Google, index and able to be found. So the next question is, how do you do this? How can I do this simply now that I understand the strategy? All right, go back to your Google Search Console, go under Pages, All Submitted Pages. You're going to see your crawled, currently not indexed, and then you're just going to pick one of these articles. Or you're going to pick one of the articles, and you're going to look at it, you're going to say, I wonder why I can't get one of these articles indexed. We're just going to then click Copy. We're going to go over to our site. Of course, this is the post that I have written for this keyword or this title, or this is the blog post. And if I look at this, this is more like what I saw at Medium, and I can understand. I don't even have any images on here. It's put together pretty well. It could be written a lot better. I need to go back, and I need to edit it, and I need to submit it again or wait for Google to crawl my site after adding a few images. And I am going to update this post, but in the meantime, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to Google, and I'm going to look for the keyword, Universe Mind Blowing Facts. That's the keyword that I want to go for. So I'm going to select that and I'm going to let Google search. I'm going to see here that there's an AI overview for it. So that may be a little stiffer competition. BBC at night, 
And then you scroll down, Tube Doctor, How Stuff Works, National Geographic, Medium. 40 mind-blowing facts about the universe. You can see there that medium.com is on the first page. And again, we're going for the keyword, universe mind-blowing facts, prepare to be amazed. The keyword that's ranking or the article that's ranking on Medium on the first page of Google, 40 mind-blowing facts about the universe. All right, so what am I going to do? I'm going to go back to that article or back to where this was not indexed, crawled, currently not indexed. I'm going to copy that URL. I'm going to go into a tool that I have called MedPoster AI. Remember, this is an AI blog update. This is about my universe unriddled AI blog. I use Koala, ChatGPT, and other forms of AI to generate the content. Then I edit it, and then I post it up on my site. I get indexed. People find it in search. They click through it. I also have a Facebook page where I'm driving traffic from Facebook to the site. I'm looking at other things like Flipboard and saying, what makes sense for me to drive traffic to my site? And one of those is Medium. So I have a Medium tool that will generate the post from my URL and post it to Medium. So I go under Campaigns. I select new campaign. Here you're gonna enter the campaign name. We're gonna come back to that. And I'm just going to come down here because I'm gonna post in the URL here. Because what this tool is gonna do is it's gonna read this article and then the AI is going to rewrite it. I'm gonna come up with a new name, 42 mind blowing facts about the universe. Cause we go back to that search universe mind blowing facts. BBC at night had nine. The one that ranked on medium had 40. So I'm gonna up it to 42. And I think the number 42 has something going on with a movie that may have happened about sci-fi. So we're going to go 42 mind-blowing facts about the universe. And here you have all these other options. I'm not really going through MedPoster AI and how it works. If you want to see that, I will link in the description. I'll put it up in the cards. Also at the end of the video, I'll end screen it for you. So you have, and you can see everything that I'm doing with MedPoster AI and this concept of SEO or Parasite SEO and Medium. But for now, what I want to do is create an informational post. In the context box, I'm going to write and give it a little more context or some extra instructions. Make sure to write 42 mind-blowing facts about the universe. Also link to my blog, give it the URL to read more mind-blowing facts. Then again, there are all kinds of other options. I'm not really gonna go through that here, but I do wanna add a medium disclosure text. This story incorporates AI assistance for creation. You can select exactly where you want it. I put it in the first two paragraphs. So it will put this disclosure in there. Then I am not going to add videos, but I am going to add images. I'm going to come down here. I don't want to extract the images from my URL. I don't want to use stock images. I don't want to search Google for images. I want AI to create the images for me. I'm going to select the GPT-40 recommended model. Leave everything as is. Come down here, publish immediately. Post to Medium. Select my Universe Unriddled Medium site. Make sure that I have it listed as a draft auto generate tags and create. Here you can see now under campaigns, 42 mind blowing facts about the universe, informational post, the status is running. That means the AI is generating the content. It's going to write the article, then it's gonna push it over to my Medium account. And then once it's in my Medium account, then I can go edit, edit it over at Medium, make any changes that I need, and then it'll be there to get indexed. Because again, over at Medium, what are we looking at here? We're looking at creating articles. Three days ago, I created this article, the Book of Enoch Overview. Google has chose not to index the URL after crawling on my site, even though I have 100 and some odd, almost 200 other pages indexed, basically following this exact same format, giving this exact same type of information. But if you go look at the Medium site that I created three days ago, after publishing it on Medium, Google has indexed it. And if I go search for the Book of Enoch and extra, Extraterrestrial Contact, you can see that it is indexed and it will be found. Now, this is my very specific use case of creating my AI blog and the subject or the topic or the niche that I chose, but this is gonna work for you across any niche, basically any niche, anything that is acceptable and to write on Medium or Quora or Reddit, any of these three sites really, they're pretty much equal in the eyes of Google, but it is gonna depend on your niche and which one has more power for you as going out and finding a reader base if you're looking to utilize that platform holistically as a traffic source by building a membership and a following on that, on that site. But what I'm doing is I'm just trying to utilize its power that Google gives it. And again, understanding the game and understanding that the rules aren't the same for my site as they are for Medium for the exact same type of content. 
And again, once you understand this, then you can take and you can understand a strategy like Parasite SEO and you can make it work for you. Here you can see my article, Dark Energy and the Universe's Infinite Size. It's informational and it has 2,086 words and it is published. So we go back to our Medium account and we hit refresh. And these are the published posts. What I actually need to do is come up here and click on stories. Then here is where you will see the draft and you can also look at your published. But here is the post right here that MedPoster AI has written for me. And then here is the title that it came up with. I didn't use the keyword as the title. So I'll play with the title to make sure that it matches. Go back to that idea of 42 mind blowing facts. But then you just scroll down through here and you look and you say, well, this is an interesting article. Of course, you'll have to make sure that there are 42 mind blowing facts, but it looks like there are. And here you go, 42 mind blowing facts about the universe. And they're literally listed 42 of them with some other content around it to fill it out. But then you can see here to read more mind blowing facts, visit this blog post and it has automatically linked back to my blog, thus building or increasing the power of my site based upon the fact that I'm utilizing Medium to get that article or to get the content in that article that doesn't rank or is not indexed on Google from my site, indexed and found on Medium, and then ultimately that funnels or leads people back to my blog. Even though that post that I've written on my blog may never index, of course I need to go back and look at it and make it a little better, we saw that. But the point is, if it was never to get indexed, it is gonna be indexed over on Medium. And again, this is down to the fact. The fact of the matter is playing the game with Google is the cards are stacked against you at this time, you have to understand that and you have to go out and you have to look. I'm not being black hat in any way. I'm not trying to manipulate search rankings and all that kind of stuff. I'm just utilizing the tools that are out there. And one of those tools is Parasite SEO using Medium, Quora, and or Reddit, and really any site out there where you can post your content and lead back to your site, knowing that your effort is not going to go overlooked just simply because Google likes medium they like reddit they like quora right now at this time you can create content there and for the most part as long as you follow the rules of that platform say medium you follow their rules and you are creating content that is helpful in the eyes of medium it will be ranked and indexed or it will be indexed and it will rank or it has the possibility of ranking and that's all we're trying to do if you want to see more about parasite seo and medium and what i'm doing with my ai blog check out the video on the screen that you see right now.